I bought these MTH traffic lights for my square in town. And the two lights you see are hooked up to one control box under the layout. So when the one light turns yellow and then red, the opposing traffic light goes green. And this cycles on and off. Now the problem is, I have four of these traffic lights and the far two are on one control box and then these nearer two are on another control box. And what happens is at some point they get out of sync and it's very easy to end up with all traffic on red for all four lights or even more dangerously for the citizens green in both directions. So what I'm going to do is crawl under the layout and see if there's a way I can wire these up to one control box so that these settings are consistent. Okay, so I'm down underneath the layout. You see the two control boxes. The boxes are fairly simple. Power goes in. This goes to the one traffic light and this goes to the opposing traffic light. Same thing over here for a different set. So what I'm going to try to do is tie this one over into this one and this one to this one and see if I can just use one box to control two sets of lights and eliminate this box. So I removed the other controller and I moved the wires that were on it and spliced them in to this one controller. So let's go up top and see what happens. Well guys, what do you see? Apparently there's been a power outage in Town Square. I flipped the power on and it got really bright for a really short period of time. Nah, I'm just joking. It's just a little LED humor. Anybody who uh, has been playing with LEDs and resistors understands what I'm talking about. It's fine. I wired it up the way I showed you and everything is in sync now. The entire square is in sync. No more accidents in this town. So that'll go yellow and then red and the opposing will go green which matches red and green both ways just as we expected. So I think we're fine. If anything the LEDs might be a little dimmer but really I can't notice it very much and I think there's some tolerance built into their circuits so I think it's fine. Worst case if I do burn up the control panel or something I got another one. <laughs> it's been running for about 10 minutes and there seems to be no issues, so it should be fine. Anyway, maybe this will help somebody who's in a similar situation.